Hello guys, so lots of people they ask me how to remove the BIOS uh, password on MacBooks uh, or EFU password. So which is very simple and uh, it's just that uh, you need another BIOS chip and uh, which is uh, already programmed just remove the older one and put the new one on and then there will be no BIOS password. So uh, uh, just look here and uh, see this password this macbook has got uh, firmware password so um, if we have got a bios chip um, which is located on this macbook is here but it has to be uh, if i show you under the microscope maybe you can see clearly yep this one here oh sorry so I have to turn on the microscope camera Okay, yeah. So, oh, come on. So, this is an auto focus, so it's just confused, you know, where to focus. So, it's not focusing right. This is where you have to focus here. Yeah. So, Guys, this is um, the BIOS chip on this one. Let's focus it again. No, it's getting confused, so we will do it manually. So, there you go. Okay, that's good enough. So I think you can see here, why not look here like this, yep, okay. So first of all I will disconnect the battery, we don't have to remove the board because it's just there but it's better if I put some uh, captain tape on it, just give me a minute. So I have covered um, the surrounding area with um, heat resistance tape and um, because I don't want anything else to go damage because this is plastic and this is plastic here with the fan as well anyway so we will just remove this chip put some flux <coughs> so this is the EFU chip on this MacBook which has got the password on it We will just remove it and put another one and hopefully we will not have any password. There you go. So, here. Yeah. And I will put just a little bit of low melt solder on it. Oh, the camera has gone off, I think. Yeah, I will stop it here. So, camera went off, and now, yep, it's all working now. So. So I will put just little bit of low melt solder here so that it's easy to put new one on. There you go. And 
more flux and um, this is the one which we have taken out a new programmed one is here okay I will just remove a little bit here from the legs it's all good so we'll put other way around here just put it here and because now we have got little bit of low melt let's put the air little bit down most of the legs I can see they are shiny but some are not yep that's it rest I can do with the soldering iron there you go it's melting like button now all done so we will give it a uh, little bit of time to cool down so I think it's uh, not completely cold but all good let me examine if everything looks okay yep and where is the put the charger in and then turn it on and hopefully we should not have any bios password now I think it's configuring the new BIOS chip that's why it's uh, hmm have I done something wrong I don't think so oh yeah there you go okay see you guys this computer will restart to secure okay restart so there is no bios password anymore so guys thank you for watching this is how you can remove uh, efi bios password from macbooks you have to locate where the efi chip is uh, got new one which is programmed replace it and hopefully there will be no password thank you very much for watching bye